we've been working on our shooting all week. Um, you know, when coach says break up and shoot, we're all taking it seriously, and I guess it paid off tonight. I know you guys heard about it all week from a lot of us about the slow starts in Washington. You guys can make quite a statement at 13 0 run in the game. Is that kind of the mindset from out there to the fast start? Yeah, that was the mindset today. We did, uh, we've been working on that in practice, and I feel the guys did a great job today coming out with a fast pace and keeping it. I'm going to just talk about uh, what you guys were able to do after they uh, closed with them. Uh, Four, four points there for about five minutes to go? We just, we didn't get rattled. And uh, that's that's big, because once you're, you stay under control and uh, you just keep making good plays, smart decisions as everybody made out there, so you're able to keep your lead and eventually win the game. How did you guys feel with uh, Eric in the lineup tonight? Uh, yeah, I think he stepped up, you know. Um, you know, coming into the lineup, you know, you can have a lot of nerves, lots of excitement, but, you know, I think he handled it great, you know, getting those couple of steals <clears throat> at the start of the game in the 1-3-1. One, one, um, I really think that got us off to a great start and couldn't be, couldn't be happier for him. You guys mixed up your defenses tonight. How big a that? It was big because, you know, this past... Um, past games that we've been playing, we've been playing a lot of man to man, and you know we figured that our length would uh, disrupt him on, with the zone and the th one three one. So you know we fell back into the the, um, the zone defense, and it helped us a lot in the, in the end. It looked like uh, we made a concerted effort to get to the hoop in the second half. Is that something you talked about at halftime, or is that just a, something you did on your own? Yeah, the coaches told me to keep attacking the rim that, that Jorge Gutierrez was guarding me, and he had uh, three fouls, so I just kept trying to push it down and uh, attack the rim, and you know, it helped me. So you think the zone is more a matchup thing, or, or are you going to try to mix it up more going forward? Uh, I think we're going to try to mix it up for going forward just to get adjusted to playing different defenses because we're going to need it down the stretch. But... Um, Keep practicing and uh, get better at all the defenses, so uh, when we need them, they can come in handy. Jared, at what point did you realize like the high screen was going to be working for you, and and when you found that out and you had the foul trouble, how much of a balance were you playing? With? Um, I was kind of hesitant at the beginning of uh you know going into the lane because a lot of them tried to slide over and take the charge, but you know Angus did a great job and Joe did a great job of setting the ball screen and uh, you know we work on that all the time in practice and you know just attacking the rim hard and making the play. Any special satisfaction being down? Uh, nah, I mean, we played hard from the beginning to the end and showed out there, and you know we knocked down a lot of shots, and you know we uh, we played hard. Uh, maybe not a must win, but how badly did you guys need this one? Big time. We needed this big to get the first one, a good one at home with a good start early, and. Uh, just try to keep moving forward. We got another one Saturday, so we're looking forward to We got to shake this off and get ready to try to win that game. Jared, you're the area. What's it like for you to beat Cal? Uh, it means a lot to me personally, but, you know, I can't really express that a lot. But, you know, um, that's one of the schools that's close to my home. And, you know, anytime you play against a home school, you want to uh, show them what you can do. And that's what we did tonight, including the team. What was the environment like at halftime? You know, it was a 38-38 game, and you guys kind of came out of the gates. <laughs> Um, you know, I think it's like what uh, Ahmad said earlier, you know, we didn't get rattled. Um, you know, coach was saying it's just, just like a brand new ball game. So, uh, and then we came into it like the same, same way we came to the start of the game. We wanted to get out of the gates, you know, well, we didn't want to fall behind or get, you know, put on the back foot. And, you know, I think to our credit, we did that tonight. And, you know, all the guys on the team, you know, just came out ready to play, in, you know, the start of the second half. Even kind of in the first half, it seemed like you guys kind of jumped out. You know, was that something you're focusing on, starting starting off better? Most definitely. I mean, I think wouldn't they, they started off five zip, right? Yeah. And uh, so, you know, we've we've been noticing that. So we're, I guess, kind of been used to, gotten used to that a little bit. But we have to fix that part as well. But. Um, just, yeah, we've been talking about the slow starts, and so just to be able to, to come back from that 5-0 to go on 13-0 run was a great thing for us. Now you got Stanford next. Uh, you know, they lost the Ducks today, so I feel like they'll be coming in here a little more amped up. 
Yeah, we are, we're on our home court, so we always going to play hard regardless. And, you know, it's another game. We've got another practice tomorrow, so we're going to go hard, prepare for that, and just be ready to play. What do you expect them to bring style-wise? You know, what do they like to do? I think they uh hard defense. They like pressure man to man. I saw from I remember last year a little bit and then watching them this year. So just pressure on the ball and then man to man, they hedge hard, different things like that. So uh we'll just prepare for that tomorrow. Not that you guys weren't confident about your team before, but does this kind of validate in your mind that you guys are one of the top teams in the house that you play and beat a team like that? Yeah, definitely. You know. Uh you know, you guys picked them to win the win the league this year. And, you know, to get a good win on them, you know, definitely uh, gives us a confidence boost, you know, going into, I guess, the season.